off with Joe Tribbiani. Apparently he missed his audition. Now, who did you speak to in my office? Estelle? No, I don't know what I'm going to do with her. No, fine. So your husband leaves you and then burns down the apartment. The world does not stop. Is anybody else scared? Right. Well, look, if Joey loses this audition, then that is it for Estelle. I don't care. Annie, you are a dog. What time can you see him? I need a What's, uh, what's my boy doing with the Barbie? He picked it out of the toy store himself. He loves it. He carries it everywhere. It's like a security blanket, okay. but with ski boots and a kicky beret. Yeah, it's, it's, it's cute. Why, why, why does he have it again? So he's got a doll, so what? Unless you're afraid he's gonna grow up to be in show business. He's not gonna do that because he's raised by two women, isn't it? You know what? It's fine. If you're okay with the Barbie thing, so am I. Give Danny the Barbie. Give, give me the Barbie. Okay, how about, don't you want to play with a monster truck? No? Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, how about a dino soldier? Oh. I got to go to work. Fun videos? Has anybody seen my oh. boob? I love that movie. Why are you doing fun videos? Sorry, just felt nice. <laughs> Joe, Joe, answer the phone. Hey, I only got one good arm, you know, you should be doing stuff for me. Go get me a sweater. <laughs> just do it. Okay, it's chance, and if I get it, I'm gonna have to see her tonight. Oh, that's right. I'm gonna have to see her tonight. What's the big deal? Why don't you want to see Janice? Okay, last night at dinner, when the meals came, she put half a chicken piccata on my plate, and then she took all my tomatoes. That's bad because... It's like all of a sudden we were this couple, okay? And this alarm started going off in my head, you know? Run for your life! Get out of the building! Men are unbelievable. What is it with you people? I mean, the minute you start to feel something, you have to run away? I know, then... That's why I don't want to go tonight. I'm afraid I'm going to say something stupid. Oh, you mean like that guy thing where you act no, all mean and distant until you get us to break up with you? <laughs> hey, do you know about that? Oh. Perfect. Hey, look, what do I do? I want to get past this. I don't want to be afraid of the commitment thing. I want to go through the tunnel to the other side. Where there's no fear of commitment. <laughs> with anything. Uh. Here, it seems to me it's pretty much like anything else, you know. Face your fear. You have a fear of heights? You go to the top of the building. You're afraid of bugs? Get a bug. In this case, you have a fear of commitment. So I say you go in there and you be the most committed guy there ever was. Amazingly, that makes sense. You think? Oh, yeah, go for it, man. Jump off the high dive. Stare down the barrel of the gun. Pee into the wind. Yeah, Joe, I assure you, if I'm staring down the barrel of the gun, I'm going to be pretty much peeing every which way. No, he finished. Look, it's your audition from this morning. Oh, oh. Mm -hmm. The trainers are going in. Sure, you know, it's like their fault. Thanks. Emergency's in now. Ten minutes.
Oh, <laughs> 
because of a job, a job created when you buy this tea at Walmart. K-12 knows this year has been a challenge for work, for school, for holding it all together. But from that challenge came some unexpected change. Distance learning meant we got to hold our kids a little closer sharing in their struggles and their discoveries. Now we find that we can get to the old school.
attractions. Okay. Thank mm-hmm. you.